point is, pineapple on pizza is not that bad. It just depends how you do it. I'm not right? even monetized on YouTube, but I'm trying not to swear at you right away. What? It's not that bad. You just gotta do it right. If you if you take chunks of pineapple no. and just throw it on pizza, that's the wrong way. No. You gotta you gotta shred it and kind of like pat it dry so it like intermingles with the cheese. How, how long does it have to be before you can swear? I think like 30 minutes. I have no idea, dude. Okay. I will... <laughs> Fudge you, YouTube. <laughs> it's kind of like the fact that, like... The fact that YouTube censorship has literally changed people's vernacular is, like... Yeah. In, in dialogue is so yeah. interesting. Not only is it interesting, but it's also... I, I don't know if there's a term for it, but it's also affecting people's vocabulary outside of YouTube. Yeah. Like, like people will say unalive when they don't need to say not unalive. So it, it, it's, it's a very odd sort of pivot in, in cultural vernacular. It's, it's, a, it's a weird sort of thing. But hello, Wallfly. Hello, DeBeast. Hello, Pinkman the First. If your name is Pinkman the First, why were you third in chat, huh? Explain that. Why weren't you the very first one in chat? No, no, I'm fucking with you. How are you doing, buddy? Dugons? Yeah. We're we're doing dungi dungeons today. Doing, we're doing some dungians. I got tea. What kind of tea? Uh, so Shay for Christmas got me Boxu, a Boxu subscription. Mm hmm And it includes, like, Japanese snacks, but it also includes tea from Japan, too. Shit. So I'm drinking a, uh, where is it? I put the package down somewhere. Dude, Warth is on a cruise. Uh, it is tell. organic hoja chai. Roasted mm. organic Japanese tea, low caffeine. Ooh. It's a very roasted green tea. It's very, very deeper flavor. I, I can't, I can't make tea without thinking of that bit from, um, Across the Spider-Verse. Like, I'll, I'll take a Kai tea, please. Chai tea, yeah. It's just like, chai, chai tea. tea? Chai means tea, bro. What, do you say you want a coffee coffee whenever you go into Starbucks? <laughs> the next room for cream cream. There's a there's a thing like that too with like I think constellations or the uh, the scientific name for bear. I think it's like bear bear essentially. Mm. Have you word. seen the fish? Have you seen the fish called boops boops? <laughs> Great. Uh Wedward, thank you so much for the tour and so for 36 months. Ah, you caught me during a roulette. That's okay. It's okay. Uh, sorry, can, for, you... sorry for starting late, by the way. Also, where the hell is my book? I need my book to know where we're at. M M Monty had to snort her neuropazine because of the uh, Yeah, because of my new, uh, what was it? Cyborg arm. Robot yeah, arm. right, my new cyborg arm. M Monty's augmented now. Yeah, I'm a, I'm a robot now. Um, we have We have five dungeons left. That's what we have left. So, hopefully, we can finish them all in the stream. That's my hope. Yeah. Yeah. So we're gonna we're gonna be doing that. Oh. So where does one need to go in order to join in? We are in Horizon on Balmung, so we we play on Balmung here. Mhm. Mm Unfortunately. Uh. I'm playing Final Fantasy, uh, is that 4? Well, you play Final Fantasy 14. Wait, you're playing Final Fantasy 4? No, uh, Zombie Jeebus in chat. I'm playing Final Fantasy 4? Is that oh, the number? Oh, yeah, that... yeah, yeah, Final Fantasy 4. Okay, I can read Greek numerals. Yeah, it's V. Wait, v, Roman numerals? V is 5, and there's a 1 behind it that's, that's 4. Yep, on the Switch. I, I bought the Pixel Remaster for the Switch, actually, um, at a local store, if you can believe it. Um, 
I hope it's good. I know, like, the Game Boy version of Final Fantasy VI is really good. I honestly would love to play Final Fantasy VI at some point again. Like, that might be the next, like, long RPG stream, I think, will be Final Fantasy VI. Because I have a, um, I have a GameCube, like, Game Boy player, so I could set it up and literally record through my, uh, That's the thing that, like, it's, like, the under part, right? Yeah. Like, you, like plug it in on top of, like, the someone, GameCube. Someone, I, I bought the disc from someone on, in my chat, actually. Oh, shit. Yeah, so. Cool. Yeah, I have to use that. I, I, I don't want to talk to you right now, man. I just saw the art you posted <laughs> on the channel, and I'm I'm getting scared. What? What's what's the matter? What's, what's... I'm I'm inadvertently becoming the leader of a cult. I don't want this. Oh. Accidentally. Well, well. Because like. Thinking about it right now, like, literally we played, we played, um, Skies of Arcadia, which was fucking awesome, and we played Final Fantasy IX, which was also awesome. Like, there's so much lore from both of those games, like, the Monty lore universe expanded. Because, mm -hmm. like, Skies of Arcadia was just a great time, um, but it also, like, had the notorious nut rant, which was, like, a whole yeah. thing. And then yeah. Final Fantasy IX is where the hentai slayer came from. Like, there's shit that just happens in those games. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. And remind me, what was the name of that old man in Skies of Arcadia with the, the mace for a hand? Mace for a hand. I, I posted him in the Netherdeep channel, because, like, the ball that he has for a hand, that's, um, that's, like, what Relic's hands are Wait, when... Wait, did you, you post it? In, in the Netherdeep channel. Oh, cat. Drachma! Yeah, yeah, yeah! Drachma, Dude, yeah. Drachma that, is that. so great. What a great character. Yeah, yeah so, um... When, when Relic does the Alter Self and makes those bowling ball hands with the spikes, that's exactly what I imagine. Oh, I can't join because I'm on Chaos DC? Can't you, like, you can travel data centers, or is Chaos... Yeah, you can. You is can. Chaos in North America? Yeah, I, I think? Maybe? I don't know. Your boyfriend just mentioned the hentai or slayer thing on the, an hour ago on his stream. Excellent. Oh, it's EU. Then you can't travel, uh, unfortunately. Damn. Drock my balls. <gasps> I got obliterated. God, what a good game. Skies of Arcadia. Oh my god. <laughs> like. You know that emoji with its arms up getting disintegrated? That's what Legatron did to me just now. Literally. Dude, Skies Arcade, like, I'm so glad I streamed it and uploaded it to YouTube. Like, it's there. I highly recommend watching that playthrough. It's so fucking good. What a great game. They need to re-release it. Like, holy shit, Sega. Just re-release the game. Like, anywhere. The only way to play it is literally on GameCube or Dreamcast, and you're gonna want to play it on GameCube. Like, you need, you need to literally just put that on Steam or put that on some other... Like, so people could fucking play it. Because it's so good. I, it, I doesn't, don't know if I... it doesn't need a remaster. That's the thing. Like, yeah, it, I'm sure, maybe. But it doesn't need a remaster. I'm kind of tired of, re like, remakes and remasters. I'm so tired of remakes and remasters. Yeah, I'm like, just re-release it. Just do a port of it. Like, you. oh my god, please. Go go into the, the, the dusty old shed back at Sega headquarters. Dust off the fucking source code of the fucking thing and just 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 put it out. Just, I don't just want put a it sequel either. People are like, oh, the, the, the creator is thinking about a sequel. I'm like, they better not because it was a nice beginning to end story. And we need some RPGs that just aren't series. Like, yep. holy shit. I agree. I agree. Yeah. Some sometimes like sometimes things just need to be their their one their and own done thing. thing. They the, yeah. books are the same way. Like yeah. I love reading a book that's like cover to cover and it, that's the story. Like yep. I hate books where it's just like oh you have to read like fifteen books in a series to understand the whole breadth of the entire thing. Don't you want to read Game of Thrones? Don't you want to? No. Although, what was, um... Stormlight Archives. Yeah, Stormlight. Yeah. Yeah, that's that, a that lot was of good. books. That's Connor a lot finished of books. that, and I'm like, was it good? And Connor was like, oh my fucking god. And I'm like, okay. 
so I need to get back into to reading that. Oh yeah, they're in Valkyrie Chronicles, that's right. Ooh. Oh, thank you, Nempo. Thank you so much. I, I appreciate the support a ton. I'm really I'm really sad I haven't been able to run just because of health stuff, but I'm hoping next time we play on Expectables it'll be a really good session. I'm really looking forward yep. to it. It was actually like I don't know if anyone else does this. I do this a lot. Um, I was literally listening to a song. Um, I like if there's a song I really like that I really like it just like. Oh man, how do I describe it? Like a song that's just like fits a moment I'm thinking of, and like the campaign or like a character. I will put that shit on repeat for like hours. No matter how the length of the song is, and just think about that thing over and over again. Mm -hmm. and it's, it's really it's such a, it's like an obsessive behavior, and it's like so messed no, up. No, no, no. Sometimes, sometimes exactly when I find a song and I'm like, wait, I'm gonna re-listen to this. Does this relate to one of my characters? Okay, it does. I'm gonna have this on loop for like the next three hours. Oh yeah, that was like Flutter and Perch for Solly. Like that was, that was Solly's song the entire time. Um, I'm trying to think of, like, other ones. Um, oh my god, it was for Gaijin's whole backstory, I would listen to Zen Ball Master from fucking Kung Fu Panda 2. Um, oh! Oh my god. Look who just strolled into town. Look. Oh, who, who strolled into town? Look, look, uh, the other way. Opposite from me. <gasps> Danny! <laughs> Hello! Hi, Danny! We got, we got a little small crowd here. Usually there's a lot more people here, but I did start late, so it's, it's yeah. kind of my own fault. But, you know. Fucking... Nice. Motherfucking Santa Claus! I'm so good at timing that, man. But, like, yeah, it puts you in the zone. I, I, I have one song for, like, the next arc for Unexpectables, though right now it's all very up in the air at the moment. There's kind of, yeah. you know... Obviously next, se uh, next session is going to be them disenchanting the orb. Mm -hmm. The zombies are going to come out of the woods and challenge them to a glizzy eating contest. Exactly. Right. Oh, man. I'm... I'm... We... <laughs> So Which excited. oh god, I, I just had an idea. Dude, there was a 3.5 monster called a famine spirit that if it bit you and crit, you would die. It would eat you. Huh. It was awful. And I'm just reminded of that with like zombies eating hot dog contest. But anyway. There's one, like there's not there's there, here's the thing, and this is a good thing, honestly. Um mm -hmm. You know, there, there's like there's not a lot of instant kill mechanics, like monster wise, for the most part. Yeah. It's usually conditional, right? Where it's like if mm -hmm. this does this, then this happens. But mm -hmm. the Dullahan in Van Richten's Guide to Ravenloft. If it crits you with the axe, you're decapitated. If it crits you, you're decapitated. You die, and I'm like, that's crazy. Like. And I mean that. That makes sense. I feel like in the Van Richtens, like like all the Shadowfell monsters, I feel like those need to be attuned to be a bit more deadly, because yeah. like they're supposed to be scary ass fucking monsters. Oh my gosh, there's there's so many good monsters in that book. Like it's insane. Yeah. yeah, I was never a fan of like three point five stuff. That's just like, oh yeah, this monster just has like. A 5% chance I, just to can kill I, you. Can I say something? Hi, I forgot. Which server are you on? Uh, we're on Balmung. We're on Balmung. Um, one of the things I absolutely f hated in Pathfinder 1, specifically, was Coup de Gras. Mm -hmm. Fucking hated oh, Coup yeah. de Gras. Coup de Gras ruined the fun of the entire game. And I'm so glad that a mechanic like that doesn't exist in the Indian Edition. I think I'm just gonna glue this tank together, Pharaoh. I was gonna try and do all the magnet stuff, but I'm really thinking that it's gonna be just too much of a hassle. <sighs> we got people showing. I see Helen. Helen is here. Yep. Danny. Good old, good old Christmas. I like that people are coming in with some Christmas glams. 
Oh, Gentle's here. Pharaoh, I'm on mobile, so I leave the polls to you tonight. Oh, fuck. Oh, God. I, man, I don't want responsibility. You're in trouble. How dare you drop cult art? <laughs> I'm in trouble. No, not you. Oh, talking, oh Gentle. I'm talking to Gentle. Gentle's in trouble. Oh. Tut, tut, tut. <laughs> I started listening to the podcast in August, and I'm five episodes away from being completely caught up. Oh, that's great. Oh, shit. Jesus. Man, so I need to, like, Positive affirmation is nice, and like mm -hmm. I, I'm very hard on myself, and like I feel like yeah, you you are you. Some sometimes you need to be like, hey, you you do cool shit, acknowledge it. I'm trying to get better about it. Like I think that's something though everyone who's creative kind of goes through. It's just oh, like, yeah. you, oh, you know yeah. you think about it, and like when I started on Expectables, I had terrible imposter syndrome. Like holy mm -hmm. shit, it was bad. Mm -hmm. But like now I'm just like, oh god, like is it entertaining? Is it good? I honestly really like where Unexpectables Two is right now, like with. Ogrun and Oberth and Gherkin and mm. like Alin and the Outsider and Empty all being kind of and Rebu, you know, all being kind of shining yeah. a little bit. So, yeah, I love everybody in the cast. Like They're different though. Like that was inevitable. Like they're gonna be different from campaign one. And like yeah. I think it's fine. I think my favorite character it might actually just be Lynn. I really like Lynn. I like Lynn too. Lynn is my Yorick because I was like, Fuck I, I, you, I'm aware. Legends. You fucked I'm, up, I'm, but I'm aware. I love it though. I'm really excited. Like right now, like the party has so many different avenues they can like kind of explore. Like, especially like if nobody dies, of course they have to disenchant the orb. But like they have Martirala, they can go and like be diplomats at. They have two mage vaults. And anything else they want to do, really. <sighs> I want to say something so bad to Hoover, but I can't because it's a spoiler for, for something and I can't say anything. Mm. Critical Role <laughs> may be interested in D&D. &D. You may be interested in DMing and making it my own. I think oh. that's important, though. That's that's art, though, right? Like, mm. I think that's the great thing about art is, like, you'll see something, you're like, I'm cool. What would be my take on it? Right? Like, mm -hmm. what would be my mm -hmm. way of doing it? I think yep. I think the trap people fall into, and this is, this is not just for D&D, &D, it's also just for anything creative, is, like, I have to be, like, this other thing because it's successful. And I think that's, like, a trap to fall no. into. It's that's like, how you end up hating what you make. Because yeah. it's, not, it's not indicative of your soul. It's like, I'm not Matt Mercer. I'm not going to make a Matt Mercer campaign. I'm going to make a Monty mm -hmm. campaign, right? Like, yep. something that my friends it, hopefully like and... It's it's why at least the good teachers that I had a lot of my good teachers back at the academy were like if you if you go to a like if you go somewhere and you're like yeah I can I can copy this guy's style perfectly that works in the industry mm -hmm. the the people are just going to be like well why don't I just hire them why why the fuck should I hire you mm -hmm. so there is there is like worth to you know being unique and finding your own way and creating art the way that is true to you mm -hmm. and I, fuck uh, all those teachers that were like hey don't draw dinosaurs fuck you yeah, and that's the i made part. 300 bucks last week drawing furry porn fuck you draco teacher. when we went to art school draco is not allowed to draw dragons at all which oh fuck sucked. off um our our teacher was very like had a very specific and like hmm. way of teaching us um she was good but like that was rough um it was kind of like a no fun allowed thing but at the same time it's like whatever I, but now draco's making money drawing dragons so it's kind of ironic yeah but, I, I should i should have the caveat if you're in like a figure drawing class yeah draw humans yeah we'll say draw, that don't, don't. That's, that's the best part i think yeah. obviously is learning yeah. that yeah. I just remember, like, I think I mentioned this before, and sorry, we, we're just letting people, like, kind of file in, and oh my god, people yeah, yeah, are yeah. filing in now, this is great. We're, uh -huh. like, we're gonna let people file in here, um, mm -hmm. but, like, uh, one of the things was, like, I remember I had my portfolio review with one of my artist teachers, my first, like, and, like, this is the last time I, like, went to class, basically, it was a, the final portfolio review of my first year of, like, post-secondary, like, like, post-high school school. And I remember distinctly my teacher, like, was looking at my stuff, and she loved my abstract work. She loved my abstract paintings, and, like, uh -huh. really, like, she liked my very stylized work, and she, like, and this is fucking, this is, like, ego-stroking myself. But, like, 
she literally looked at me dead ass and went, you will never be able to draw realistically. Like, she's like, realism is just not in the cards for you at all. You, you struggle with it to a point where I don't think you'll ever be able to do it. And I was like, ow! <laughs> okay. But she's just like, but that's, I don't think that's, you know, I don't think that's anyone's fault. I think it's just you perceive the world differently. Which I freaked me out, because I'm like, am I just seeing things differently? But she looked at me and she said, but your composition and, like, your way, the way that you come up with an idea and you execute it is really good. And honestly, that's going to take you farther in a career. <laughs> and I was like, oh, okay. <laughs> There's some salve in that wound. That's nice. And looking at what I'm doing now, she was kind of right. Like, if I can think of something and I can at least compose the idea and then, you know, sometimes I can do it myself. Like, Wark, for example. Wark, I think, is, like, the second time I've ever done official art for the Unexpectables of my own art. Yeah. Um, Because the first one was the fortune teller. I drew the fortune teller. Mm -hmm. And then Wark I drew because it was, like... It's like Morden from Mass Effect. I had to do it. Someone else would have gotten it wrong. And I'm like, not that anyone else couldn't have done it. It was just like, I really, like, I drew, I, like, I'm like, I'm gonna see if I can draw work myself, right? And then I did it, and I'm like, this is, this is how I want him to be seen as. Like, this is, literally, I shit you not, work. I didn't do any, like, concept art. I, like, which is, like, a lot of times, and this is not being, like, I never do concept art. Every time I've done a character, there's several iterations of them, or they've evolved, or I've gone through, like, mood boards and rethought stuff. But Wark was like, I knew what the scepter looked like in my head. Mm -hmm. And I was like, what if this thing was alive? And then I just broke it down, and I'm like, there he is, that's Wark. And then mm -hmm. it was, like, one page <laughs> that I have. I should probably find it and upload it, because it's on, pretty neat. On Wednesday, I threw this character at my players. It's a, it's a bone claw. Lizard folk bone claw. Oh yeah, you posted this on your on your Twitter. This is so fucking mm. cool. Yeah, she is crazy. <laughs> I would imagine. Yeah. No, no, I, I, she, she's a really fun character because so the big bad evil guy has scried on the party before, mm. and shadow claws are all about being sneaky and like hiding in the shadows and stuff. So she grabs Junk's character is like, I am such a big fan of how you could just hide no matter where you go. You can just hide anywhere and just, I'm a big fan. Just wow, wow, like, killing the shit out of Chuck's character. Really Jesus. Fun. I was wondering, because yeah, we were playing today and you mentioned this to Leah. Yeah, yeah. Bone claws are scary. They're CR 12, but they're high level. Uh, people are just asking what we're doing today in the game, so I'm just going to let them know oh, oh, yeah. what. Let the peeps know. God, I have to go back to being a healer again, which is funny because I, I leveled Sage. Actually, I, I want to show the chat something. All right, that's what we have. Um, I'm going to just show it real fast here. I have... To prove that I am a gamer. Oh? I, uh... <laughs> I've, been, I've been leveling, let's just say that. I won't lie, while I've been recovering, I've been painting and playing 14. 90s across the board, except, except for gun. I need my gun. Except for machinist. I need my license. Uh, and then I have all these I need to level too, of course, but I'm I'm almost I've almost got all come, the classes leveled. Why don't you come down to the States and I'll show you a two or a thing or two about uh holding a piece. I actually don't know shit. I, d I don't know any guns. I Nobody shot in my guns family before. Guns. I, I shot a 22, which I really liked. Not like in a psychotic way, but like it was okay. I, I shot paint, oh. like little pop cans oh. with it. I'll say this. I, th I think guns are cool technology. I, d I just don't like them. <laughs> yeah. Um, I shot a shotgun. Did not enjoy that at all. I, I don't really have, like, now they're better, but I had bony shoulders and that, you know, shotguns kick and they're very mm -hmm. fucking loud and then pretty mm -hmm. terrifying. Um,. But I shot it once, turned to my dad, and went, yep, nope, and I, I walked away. I'm like, I don't want to, I just give me the 22. I'll, I'll shoot with the 22. I've also heard that, like, with, with higher caliber guns, if you have more meat on your body to, like, take the recoil, yeah. it's better. Oh, yeah, 100%. No offense, you're kind of a string being, so, like, it's hitting your bone and stuff uh, when the recoil does. Nampo asks, do you have a favorite class? Uh, at least a favorite mm. class. I'm actually, my favorite class is not white mage. My favorite class is red mage. 
Mm -hmm. This is my red mage glam. I I very main, cool. I main red mage for like hard content and stuff. Chocobo knight. This is my chocobo knight glamour. Uh, this is one of my favorite classes. I also actually quite like samurai. Samurai is also my favorite. We're actually gonna have some samurai once we get to other expansions. A foolish samurai boy. But we're gonna we're gonna stick to white mage. White Mage is definitely my favorite healer. I, I've leveled all the other healers, and White Mage is definitely my favorite. Oh, yeah. I think White Mage is, yeah, my favorite healer. Yeah, it's just... I know too many people who like to play the the um, shield healers, so... Yeah. All right, it is 8 p.m. Uh, ladies and germs, we're actually going to take a boat. Uh, so, are you guys ready to take a boat? We're going to take a boat. We're going to go to Limsa. Because we need to head back to uh, to Grey Fox Longstop. That's gonna be our first dungeon of the uh, of the game. So, all right, everyone, mount up, chocobos up. Thank you so much, everybody, for for riding on your chocobos. I think I said this last stream, but I do really appreciate it that people are riding on chocobos. It's it's good for a lot of reasons. One, it avoids spoiler mounts because there's plenty of spoiler mounts in this game. Two, it also doesn't like block the screen. And I feel like it gives everybody here, like, a personal character touch, right? Like, every chocobo, like, look at this guy. Ooh, he's got a little helmet on. Shotan's got, he's got googles on, so that way his eyeballs are okay. Like, it just tells a little story, and I, I really enjoy it. And thank you guys, thank you guys so much for kind of, you know, rolling with that. I, I appreciate it a ton. It's just nice not to have the screen, like, blocked by, like, giant whale mounts and stuff like that, or the walking spoiler. Especially for people yep. who are, like either in like in the game or watching the stream and like w are kind of experiencing the story for the first time all right everybody we are heading out that direction let's see who did their homework let's ride run 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 let's go let's go go chocobos go look at them all run yeehaw <laughs> i feel so bad because i was like hey miss sweetums where are you at in the story miss sweetums like oh i'm here but I stopped because I had to get the writing maps because you told me to. And I'm like, no, I'm a bad guy. I'm a villain. You're, you're the bad guy. Bad Duh. guy. Do, 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 do. That song is so much fun. Yeah, yeah. This is very... I don't even know. I don't remember the artist who sings it or anything. Uh, just... Billy... Uh, something Billy. Billy Eilish? Is no, it Billie Eilish? Is it Billie Eilish? I don't know music. I'm really I, bad. I don't, I don't know pop music either. Yeah. All right. We are taking a boat. Right? Oh, no. Over here. I went to the wrong boat dock. This way, everybody. All right, everybody. Everybody. I gave you... I, I, if you need money for the boat, let me know. We're going to take in the boat. We're going to Limsa Liminsa. Oh, God. We're I'm gonna on go, a boat. We're going to go through Limsa Liminsa. Shit. Oh, God. You got a little cutscene. Oh, I do I've never done this. Oh, that's cute. I've never done this, so. Alright, guys, no falling overboard. Put it on our tab. Yeah, we got a boat tab now. <laughs> you turn me into a blue mage just for the maps. I'm sure that's gonna make some people in chat happy, though. Can I bum some change? I only have 2 million gil. Oh, dude, I've been making bank from crafting recently. Oh, it's snowing! I didn't realize there was a whole ass cutscene for this. This is great. Yeah, we're not going anywhere near the cut the, the quicksands unless the plotline calls for it. <laughs> Even if also, look at this captain's it. cone hat. What is he wearing? What is that? I don't know. Right, That's cool. Alright, everybody be on your best behavior. We are literally running across to the other side. We're going to the middle of Nosha, so... Alright, let's get moving, everybody. Run as a big crowd. Let's go. Let's go. Let's move. Let's go. Run. <laughs> Look at us. We're just Run. a huge Run. crowd. We're Holy going to shit. middle Lenosha? We're just going across, so we just have to keep running until we hit the other side. So Run, get, get moving, everybody. Get you moving. 
<laughs> this is this is my stopping grounds. Dude, this is like there's such a. Cr I'm always here. Like I'm usually here crafting, and like this is such a huge, massive amount of people. People are gonna be like, "What the fuck is happening?" Just keep running. Someone random in chat just said, "Run!" <laughs> Run! Everyone, keep moving. The RPers are running. This, who is this? We have Irvenheim. That's a cool name. I like that. The 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 <laughs> annual running of the RPers. Right. Well, there was the 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 Fembro Fest. That was great. Oh my god. Remember That's right. That was back when I was quarantining with you. Yeah. There was a there was a Fembro Festival where everyone was like, make way. <laughs> oh my god. All right, we'll wait outside here. Make sure we didn't lose any stragglers, just because people have to load as well. All right, hold, up. brothers, hold. Everyone, wait up. We gotta wait for all our people to make it through. Let's mount up. Uh, we are heading to where the fuck are these brain blocks? Uh, I think that's east. Oh, customize my choker. Oh, so we are gonna head north. We're gonna go all the way north, and then we're gonna hop over to eastern Lenosha. There was a Femro Fest and I missed it? Yeah, there was a Femro Fest. There was a giant parade of Femros. Yeah, it, it happened, great. um... It happened last year. Alright, like everybody. Like, in, in, like, August or July. I think it was July when I was over there, yeah. Get moving. Get you moving. Alright, alright, alright. Alright, let's go. We're pissed off the Gubu! Why would you do that? TD. This is where we filmed stuff for the uh, the intro, actually, the trailer yeah. I, I made for yeah. uh Stuff between two Rogan and fucking hell. Uh, you know you like it. Uh God I wish that were me. God I wish that were me. I love Lenosha. It's probably my favorite like mer mm. like area in a realm reborn. I actually finished my entire fishing log here. How are we doing? How many people are gonna jump off? <laughs> Look at them all falling. <laughs> They're all jumping. Keep going, keep my, moving. Mind, mind the giant enemy crabs. Oh, dude, Thera, can I just say something? I mentioned sure. this before to Indy. I'm feeling great, man. Yeah, I'm, I'm happy. Like, just, this, this is the just best. Just don't overdo it, please. I know, I'm trying not to, man. I there, want to do like a thousand. There are so many times. times where, like, you're sick for a while and you're like, the first time you say, like, I feel better. And then you overdo it and then you're back to being sick. So just take it easy. Yeah, I've, I'm trying my best not to do anything. Oh my god, it is rainy in Wineport. Oh my god. Oh, is it? Is it showering? It is. Yeah, it showers. Dude, fishers rejoice, man. This is the weather pattern you need for so many fucking rare fish. Where, where is Bray Fox Longstop? I think it's this way. I think it is. Yeah, it yeah, is. I, yeah, I'm... yeah, yeah. All right, we're going down this way. Sorry, navigation, my bad. There are already people on the road. Mm-hmm. Where are we going here? I don't know why, but this area, like, reminds me of- Do you guys remember Mabinagi? The MMO what? Mabinagi? Does anybody- No! Does anybody in my chat know Mabinagi? I do not know Anyone who played Maple Story might know what Mabinagi is. It's made by the same company. Tis Disco Tech Priest knows it. Yep. Hold on, I'm gonna go up there on that rock for story time. Hel Helen? You oh, oh. move. Story time. You gotta I'm get down. Sorry. You gotta crisscross applesauce. They're they're trading me something. Not a towel. I need it. Alright. Get off the rock. Crisscross applesauce, everybody. It's story time. Are you guys ready for the story of Bray Fox Longstop Hard? That's my journal. I don't. I don't want that. I need my duty finder. And then I need to go to dungeons. And I need to go to a realm reborn. And I need to go to Ray Fox Longstop Hard. All right. 
You guys ready for story time? Yeah! Alright, let's let's do story time, everybody. I'm gonna look down. Alright, everybody, it's story time. Time for Bray Fox Longstop. Last time we were here, we had to uh, fight a dragon uh, for goblin cheese. Uh, but this is the hard version. So let's uh, let's read here. Bray Fox's Longstop is overrun with forces of the Illuminati. <laughs> The furious goblin scholars are bent on recovering a secret recipe centuries in the making and a moment in the f in the filching. Having been pressed into service as Brayflox's boon companion, you have no choice but to disregard the facts of her thievery and defend the long stop from all those who would seize it from its rightful holder. Alright. So once again, just a reminder as we do these dungeons... Uh, we do not need a healer. I will be the healer for these, so if you're thinking about coming in as a healer, uh, don't, because, uh, I am the healer. I am the one who heals. Uh, we are gonna do a party finder. We're gonna be doing a private party finder here. We're gonna be doing dungeons. We're gonna be doing... Let's do dungeons. Uh, Bray Fox Long Stop Hard. Boom. Uh, our password will be 1192. Our password tonight will be 1192. Alright? 1192. We do not mm -hmm. need a healer. We need a tank and two DPS. Get in here. We gotta, we gotta fight some gobos, some goblins. Goblins. Also, I saw Thorn is here. There's Thorn. He got an umbrella! Damn it, he's so resourceful. And so does Danny. Damn it, they're so resourceful. And we have Irvenheim. I don't remember. Maybe I'm. Am I stupid? Your name is so cool. How can I forget someone with such a cool name like Irvenheim? They have a flower next to them, which means they're a returning player. Who is this mysterious soul? Who is Irvingheim? I don't know. What is their tale? What is their story? It's so nice seeing, like, <laughs> the turning faces. When I loaded up and there weren't that many people arriving, I was like, oh. But the people who showed up, I was excited for. But Irvenheim is me. So, I just returned after hiatus. Oh my god, he's back. The Return of the King. So, it's a, it's a, it's, it's a pretty documented thing that Twitch will not say, like, if you're live until, like, ten minutes afterwards. Mm -hmm. Like, it's, it's just, it's just a thing. All right. Hell yeah. Alright, we looks like we have our party. We have Callie Mooton as our bard. We have Danny Punch Your Face with a gun. Excellent. Uh, and we have Brought Weed a Pumpkin something. Brought Weed a Pumpkin something. Where's Brought... Huh. I see Brought Weed a Pumpkin, but it's cut off. Pumpkin Munch. That's it. Right there. There you are. Your Pumpkin Munch. Hello. Damn, we got a badass over here. Hello! <laughs> Alright. Are we good? We're going to war. By the way, uh, brought we're gonna we're gonna do a stress test here, okay? I'm gonna actually eat something before we go in. Or drink, rather. Uh, brought Wida, I want you to go for the most absolutely batshit nuts pulls. Like, the first one, I want you to wall-to-wall -wall pull, and I want to see what happens. Just use your mitigation, please. And make sure to use arm's length when it gets really scary, okay? Can you do that for me, Bratwita? I want to fuck this shit up. You got it? All right. Let's do this. All right, have a, fun, everybody. Do a ready check here. The rest of you guys, try not to get too wet out here, eh? I brought my umbrella. All right. Bray Fox, long stop hard. Let's ride. I remember this dungeon having Here good they music. Go. Alright. Holy shit, they got artillery. And, like, cheetahs. They're blowing up the dinosaurs! No! Got goblins and and single brain-celled organisms. Oh. All right. 
<laughs> so goblins. So goblins. Wow. <laughs> All right, Bravita, uh, go for it. All right, Brayflox is with us as well during this. This is a good one to have a map open for, actually. I have a, I have a somewhat decent instant cast here. And I mean, I have, uh... I have Benediction if it gets really scary. And if not, I have, uh... Rotweeda might have their, uh... I'm gonna get rid of that paralysis off of you. Alright, alright, alright. Other people are being attacked. I'm gonna lose them here. Alright, this is our pull. This is our pull spot here. Or is it? No, it is not. We still have a ways to go. Holy shit, this is- this is a pole! I like this. There's Holy no other shit. kill like overkill. I'm being- I'm Holy being, shit! I'm being stabbed. Holy shit! Hang in there! It's fine, we're doing good. This is- this is a nice pole. This was very comfortable, actually. Gambate! That's my tank! That's my purse! I don't know you! Really green, though. Alright. We got a tiny key. Open this gate. Good pull, everybody. That was excellent. Good job. Illuminati Commander. He's just a scary goblin with an axe. To grind. Hashtag that's my tank. Hell yeah. Let's go. Better. I want to see you munch that pumpkin. Let's go. Um, I'm just gonna give this to you. You can have that. That's yours. Oh no. Ow. That guy's got a gun. He's shooting people. That's Danny's job. Shoot. Oh god, landmines! Oh my god, they planted landmines! Fuck our dogs out there! Gotta throw some more rocks, gonna throw up some, some wind there. The cave goblin a gun? Oh my god. Oh, Bray Floxes wants us to follow her. Alright. Again, mess me up, Rawita. Go nuts. Go schnutty. Bray Fox is gonna watch our backs. Aren't you tired of being nice? Don't you wanna, Don't you wanna go ape shit? The, the, the plural term for a group of goblins, a bungle. A bungle? A bungle of goblins? A bungle of goblins. <laughs> we're good, we're good, we're good. These gamers, you're gaming. We can fight the Illuminopoly. That, that, that's not... Oh, we freed some goblins. Okay. Many thanks, many thanks. Alright, everybody, get in the hole. Go. I don't care what you smell. Get in there. Get in there. Ignore the fact that it's using purple fart gas. It's time to go. 
I got a really cute picture of Hobbin Go- uh, oh my gosh, wow, that's quite the slip. Uh, Spriggan and Goblin. Uh, recently. Like, while we are doing D&D, I got up and I took a picture of them. Oh. Alright, we got a giant Pacific Rim mech. Oh I'm so glad that the first movie didn't ever get a sequel. Yeah, me too. Just a one-off good movie. Can I confess something to you? Sure. I have never seen Pacific Rim. It's good. I love it. If, if you like Guillermo del Toro's work, it's it's a love letter to just giant monsters and giant mech stuff. It does sound fun. It is it is a very fun movie. It's I think I I mean I have a poster of it like in my room. I love the uh, the little story about how um, one of the act little actors who is uh, Mako Mori's um, yeah like, she couldn't version. say his name. He started to say his full name, so she he, he said, you can call me Totoro. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so it's like, that's so cute. I know you're not a movie guy, or fucking, wow, movie wow. person. high five, slip Woman. ups tonight, let's go. God, well, I know you don't like movies, but, um... I don't dislike I, movies, I, I just don't enjoy them, like, all, like, I, I really have to be in the mood for a movie. I, I do recommend Pacific Rim, because... It's 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 a really fun just monster movie, monster mech movie. I love it. Every now and again, I'm like, I really want to see a specific movie, and then I don't see it. I really want to see The Boy and the Heron. Actually, I want to go see that with Darcy. Mmm, yeah. Fucking Robert Patterson's the fucking Heron. Yeah, it's like a creepy Heron in that, and I'm like, that's yeah. interesting. Yeah. I, I love looks, the story. Like, it's also creepy. It looks exoteric and weird. Yeah. All right. I, I love the fact that like the the people the voice directors are like no way no way Robert would like actually want to voice act that creature, and apparently it was when he heard about it he's like yes yes give me it give Am me. Am I gonna fight the big tiger? Okay, this is an optional enemy, but sure. Yeah. I was gonna say uh, that's the thing with Robert Pattinson like people always think he was like the Twilight guy, but he's actually a very decent like actor. He's quite good at it. Yeah. He yeah, also not hated, only... he hated Twilight too. He thought it yeah, was yeah. super pretentious. Did did you hear that he actually went on a date with a fan and all he did was complain about how shitty his job was and all the shitty aspects of his job and she just left. Amazing. She, like like, oh you wanna you wanna like date me? Okay and just welcome immediate... to the burden. Yeah, welcome to I'm just gonna tell you about the worst parts of my life and job and stuff. And she and she was like, oh nope, nope, fucking bailed. What a fucking Chad. <laughs> yeah, Pattinson's really good. When people are like super upset that he was playing Batman, I'm like, he's done he's his like Oh, the lighthouse, that's right. He did the lighthouse, yeah. yeah. He did some, he's done some really good films. And uh, the girl who played Bella is also a very good actor. The problem mm -hmm. was they were in Twilight and that is yeah. just you know hey, cuts it, sorry. Hmm. Oh shit. Oh shit, they're squaring up. <laughs> Illuminati will not have cheese. Oh shit, Brayflox, get him! Oh no! Holy shit, she got shot. Oh my god. Damn. You shot Brayflox, you bastards! Knowing of cheese make is gobby secret. All cheese recipes are belong to Illuminati. Oh my god. Cheese is meant for everybody, you bastards! Should have had you at my party here. Yeah. Uh, I play with you enough. Like let uh, let other people play. Uh, yeah, Robert Pattinson was also Batman. Yeah. I, I actually haven't seen I, that. I haven't either. seen that I, performance, so I can't obviously I have no idea if his performance was good or not. Yeah. I can't say, but this music The point is, the guy's got range. It, it's it's kinda like Clear a these out, we need space. Clear them out. Holy holy clears them out.
Oh! You get hit. Watch out, this thing is gonna... There we go. Nice, good job, good job, good job. Ow! It's okay. Me and Danny got shot. Thank you. Guys, I'm being shot! I don't even know actors, but... Yeah. I'm glad Hayden Christensen is doing stuff he loves again. Yeah, he's still doing Anakin Skywalker in, in new stuff, and I'm so happy to see that. I, I, honestly, you know what one thing I'm really happy to see is Adam Sandler doing a kid's movie. I think Dude, I, I watched Leo! It's so good! I'm well, like, everyone's like, oh, it's really good. I'm like, I, it feels like his comedy style just works way better for that sort of, like, movie, honestly. Yeah. It's it's not like it's not like winning best animated feature of the year, but it's a good movie. I heard, it's, like, I heard it's delightful, yeah. Yeah, with like with like really hard. Oh god! Oh god! Of, like, There's so many guns. Danny, help me! Do you, do you mind ah. if like I do you mind if like I spoil like my favorite moment? Uh, let's finish the dungeon okay, first, okay, and okay. then we can talk about it. Okay, 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 yeah. We'll focus <laughs> on the fight because I. My, I was over at my partner's last week, and they were just like, "We have to, you're, you're dinosaur lizard man. We're watching Leo." We're watching like, Leo, oh. yeah. And it was surprisingly good. Oh, oh god! Ow! Oh god! Uh, there's a big bomb. Ow. I gotta run over. <laughs> ah, Danny! No! Oh my god, Danny. I got you. I got you, Danny. Holy shit. Benediction. Oh, oh, oh god. Uh, holy shit. Did anyone get the, the license plate of that vehicle? <laughs> Jesus Christ. Oh my god, you killed the crew too. Hey, good job. <laughs> Danny took one for the team. He took he got hit by a car! Yeah, the got ran over. Alright, Thera, are you ready? Yep, so Callie, Danny, and Blotwita. How do you spell blood weed? Wait, hold on. I... This guy just said the secret ingredients must never be revealed, and this one said, wait, the secret ingredient is... Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god. Alright, our, our our lovely accommodations today are Danny, mm -hmm. Bratwita, Bratwita, okay. B-R-O-T, Yep, okay. W-Y-D-A, Okay. And then Callie. C A L L I E. Alright. Going out. We've won the cheese, everybody. My person accommodation is gonna be Bratwita. That was a good pull. I appreciate you doing the big pull that I would like. That was very nice of you. Isn't isn't the secret uh, maybe I'm I'm maybe someone just told me this and it's not true, but isn't the secret green ingredient to gob gobby cheese gobby milk? Uh. Nobody tell Bracky. He would just eat nothing but cheese. Live live food review. Yeah, Shay got me a uh, boxu box for Christmas. Her and her sister. Uh, uh, Monty Mukbang stream when? I don't know what this is. It's all Japanese. I have no idea what this is. Hold on. Bratwita is the winner. Bratwita is the winner. Nice. Congratulations, Bratwita. Thank you so much for a fantastic poll. You did very, very well. I was very impressed. Nice. Um, but um, there, there's this bit in like Leo. Hold on. Let me let me let me review oh, yeah. the snack while you're, oh, yeah, while yeah, yeah, you're yeah. doing that. It's chocolate, I think. Mm -hmm. 
What is this? Watch it be like a jalapeno inside or something. It's got nuts in it. <laughs> but it's good. Oh. Okay. Huh. It tastes like a protein bar. Hmm. Okay. Is that good or bad? I don't know. I don't eat protein bars, so I just... I don't know. Hello, everybody. I'm back. All right. Tell me about Leo. Sorry. But um, I, I, I just really liked this one part where, like, you, you know the whole plot is, like, he's a lizard that, like, gives kids advice and stuff. Yeah. And um, one of the kids was like, aren't, aren't you getting kind of worried about, like, how old you're getting and, like, stuff like that? And Leo, Adam Sandler's character, Leo's just like, I'm just happy to still be here. And it's, like, so sweet. Aww. And just, like, like, just, like, man, what a wise, like, thing to say to, like, like, a kid that's, like, worried about, like, the future and stuff and yeah. worried about, like, friendship and stuff. Just, like, I'm just happy to still be here. And it's, yeah. like, aw. That's cute. Aw, man. It's a really cute movie. It's, it's, again, it's not, like, blow your socks off, like, like best animated feature ever, the, but... The craziest thing is... It's like, better than Wish! I know. It's a hell of a lot better than wild Wish! wild to me. Also, Nempo, take care. Thank you so much for your kind words earlier. I, I really do appreciate yeah. it. All right, everybody. We did it. We got the secrets of the gobby cheese. We saved the cheese, everybody. Hip hip hurrah! Yeah. Hip hip hurrah! Hip hip, hip yahoo! Yeah. We did it. We saved the cheese, everybody. I just did slash cheese by accident. Yahoo! We saved it from the Illuminopoly. Alright, where are we going next? That I was that. Brave Fox. Again, if you guys were part of this uh, this group, uh, you'll have to sit out for the next one, I'm afraid. Yep. yep. Uh, where even is this? Hold on. Sorry, this one's kind of weird. Where do I go? Mm -hmm. Where where is it? What is it? Uh Hullbreaker Isle is where we need to go next. Hullbreaker Isle? Where do we enter Hullbreaker Isle? Morby Dry Docks? Oh, Morby Dry Docks. Okay, thank you. We're going to head to Morby Dry Docks. Thank you so much. I'm going to I'm going to we we'll, we should go there anyway if we can't really find a good access point. Morby Dry Docks is... Where is Morby Dry Docks? Oh, okay. We gotta go south, guys. We're heading south. We got a long way of travel. Everyone get your chocobos ready. Get them, have them watered, watered, have them greased. Let's move. Let's go. Let's ride. Where are we headed to? Lower Lenosha? We are heading to, yeah, Lower Lenosha. God, look at the look at this jungle at night though. Like, yeah, it's very this cool. Is I so, love the glowing. This plants. is so cool. We're all riding on our chocobos through a nighttime jungle scene after saving cheese. What a fantastic experience, man! Brings a goddamn tear to my eye. There's a boo boo in the middle of the road. It's fine. He lives here. Yeah. <laughs> I love that goo boos have the heavy weapons guy proportions. They really do, and the flat butt. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Got no cake whatsoever. Absolutely no cake, but they still have a, a, a little a little crack, which is really cute. Alright. Goobas are the ugly bastards of, of Final Fantasy XIV. Oh, they're cute. I like them, they're cute. They're cute until they open their mouth and you see all the teeth. They're cute. Crocodiles have lots of teeth and they're cute. You know what? That's fair, yeah. You know what? My mistake. I've, 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 I'm so foolish. Oh god, I'm off-roading. Oh. Is there a dodo mount in this game? There is, yes. Yeah. I want it's, a dodo. it's really funny. 
Uh, I mean, like, look at this. These bridges with the creeks running under them. Oh. There's something so adventurous about walking over a bridge with a creek underneath. Hmm. You're not getting your feet wet. You're, you're just... Making a bridge. Uh, oh, that's a that's a rare spawn there. Ooh, uh, <laughs> gentle's looking at it actually. Do we want to kill this? <laughs> yeah, big man spotted. What, we, do we want to kill this big man? Hold on. We, One we'll, second. We'll pop this in like two seconds. Tell go, me when. Go for it. Go. Now. Ah! <sighs> get him, oh boys! God. It's so... <laughs> this thing didn't stand a chance. Hey, you get allied seals for it. That's what you yeah. need for the uh, the treasure maps. Yeah. Or the uh, the riding maps, rather. Mm -hmm. Good job, everybody. Oh, wait, no, Good murder. Not the lizard. Not the lizard. Choke him up. Good murder, everyone. I'm proud of you. Alright, we're here. We're at Moor Bay Dry Docks. Hooray. I loved running past Gentle. Just like, like Aya standing in front of this giant snake thing. Just like, mm. hmm. Did we just do a drive-by? No, it was a... Um, it was... It it's, was it's, it was a drive-by. Yeah, yeah. yeah drive -by. There's no... I just can't really defend that one. Sorry. <laughs> yeah, yeah. That's... Yep. Yeah. All right, me hardies. Let's line up. We're gonna line up over here. Oh god. Uh, right here. There's more space. Look, everyone's loading up on the dock. Oh my goodness gracious. What do you think about Danny? You good? Goodness gracious. God, she is focused. All right. Uh, can I steal that barrel from you, Demi Moon? Can I have the barrel? It's a story time. I need to crisscross out the sauce these fools. Thank you. Alright. Barrel has been obtained. Alright. Crisscross applesauce. Alright. Is everybody ready for the story of Holebreaker Isle? I love this dungeon. I love the story with this. I don't know if it'll explain it in the description, but uh, Enzi here who is uh, Meryl Wib's right-hand guy. If you remember him, he's the male Rogadin who hangs out with Meryl Wib. Oh, he's the right-hand guy, all right. Uh, he's, I love both of them a lot. <laughs> uh, he sends you to Holebreaker Isle. This is, he gives you this quest. Let's read about Holebreaker Isle, shall we? This is one of my favorite dungeons in the Realm Reborn, just for the plot line, anyway. <laughs> Upon the Rotano Sea, along the fringes of the island chain known as the Sildalius, Sildale there stretches an expanse of water per perpetually covered in heavy mist. Hidden within this impregnable trout is Hullbreaker Isle, so named for having smashed innumerable hapless vessels into flotsam over the centuries. In the wake of the calamity, however, it came to be that the mist would lift under certain conditions, on one such day, a merchant man sailed into the area to behold not only the isle itself, but also the wreck of the Har, the flagship of the dread pirate Mistbeard. The discovery has rekindled interest in Mistbeard's legendary horde, and treasure hunters the realm over are now scrambling to find passage to the elusive isle. And you are sent to go investigate by Master Enzi here. Alright, so, once again... Uh, if you were in the party for Bray Fox Longstop, you'll have to sit out. I'm very sorry. Um, however, we need a tank and two DPS. There are no need for healers. Um, so let's, let's get in for this. The password is 1192. Can you post that in the chat? Already 1192. on it. 1192. And we are recruiting now. It's time, to, it's time for a pirate adventure, everybody. Everybody. Also, I realized I didn't do my talking emot emoticon. I'm very sorry. After everyone crisscross applesauce. So, only half of you fools crisscross applesauce. Aya is rotating! Yeah, Aya's just been rotating. A a Aya be in the microwave like... Mm. 
<laughs> You're too Why is that so good? What the hell, Pharaoh? I I've had practice. <laughs> Man, I, I, that reminds me of that picture I sent you with the story in it. I really want to message our call and I'll be like, I'll see you later, Beans. Oh, God. Please send that to him. Oh, my God. All right. We have Shotan, Genel, and Urbanheim. Oh, the cool dude himself. Let's go. All right. Let me do a ready check here real fast. Paro microwaves a lot. I don't microwave that much. I actually enjoy cooking. You, I love how you said that in a way that did like you food was not involved. Like it was just like I don't microwave a lot. This is to say you microwave you yourself as a person <laughs> yeah. microwave. All right. I mean, technically, you microwave yourself going outside with like the sun. It's gamma radiation. We're going to Hole Breaker Isle. I've had enough of this. Let us commence forth. Wait, Cutscene. are microwaves gamma radiation? Am I dumb? Cutscene. Oh, sorry. All the music. Oh, we should have come here during the day. Oh, I love it. All the broken ships turned into houses. Monkey! I think the sun is rising, though. That's my favorite joke from Chowder. The sun is rising. Just <laughs> breathing fire over the cliff. All right, let's see it, Irvinheim. Watch out for the bear traps. Oh, I didn't slide past. Not, not based. Kinda cringe. I'm very sorry. Oh. Genel got, got stuck in the... Oh god. Oh god, Urbanheim. Jesus. Microwaves You're fine. use... He didn't die. Microwaves use electromagnetic radiation? Is, is the sun a different type of radiation? The sun is a deadly laser. Uh, there's a monkey behind us. Guys? 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 Guys, there's a monkey! Guys, there's a monkey! He's got nuts! He's throwing them at me! So... All of the energy from the sun that reaches the Earth arrives as solar radiation, part of a large collection of energy called oh God, the electromagnetic oh radiation spectrum. <gasps> Alright, we're doing great. Those bees are terrifying. <laughs> <laughs> if anyone gets caught in a bear trap, you're cringe! Just joking. Ah, oh, it snapped my ankle up! Dude, that's kind of cringe. It's like never broken a bone. Help me, I'm bleeding to death! Dude, that's kind of cringe, stop it. You're a beta male, I'm not going to help a beta male. <laughs> oh god. So dumb. Oh, only alphas here. This is the alpha stream where you have to snort protein powder and, and eat nothing but rice and chicken breast. No, you gotta eat nothing but falcon eggs, protein shakes, and rocks. Oh my god. If your oh, deadlift isn't God. 12 tons, then you're a beta male. You're fucking Donkey Kong. All right. <laughs> Monty, have you seen the round meal? Well, yes, I have. Okay, it okay. It took good. me a second. I was like, yeah, I remember the round okay. meal. <laughs> okay, good, good. All right. Apparently it's fake, but it's still a funny picture. It's 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 a Sasquatch. Get Sasquatch. it. Sasquatch. Sasquatch. 
Also, I'd like to apologize to the people who watch the stream and also the YouTube uploads. I'm sorry my monitor is so big that all the text is really tiny. Mm. Oh god, he's pissed. He's pissed. Hold on. Hold on. Come here. Now. Come here. Come here. Have a banana. Have a banana. Have a banana. There you go. Banana. Nice. Constable Mutton, we can't live on the sun. It is too hot. Uh, how many bananas did we knock down? Uh, guys? He's got three attack boosts because he ate three bananas. Uh, Urban? Banana. <laughs> uh, 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 uh. No, no, ah! Fucking monkey! Oh, this is this is just a unexpectables fighting druid yeah, in Delvaria literally. colorized. Colorized, yeah, 3D <laughs> experience. I like Shusa though. Very fun character. Old old no lady. Old old druid woman. Uh, I actually, I did really love that world building moment where Iskan got to sit down and like ask about like oh God, what Druid, oh God, Druid stuff is all about. Sorry, repeat that. I, I had to oh, prevent a disaster. I, yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I, I just really liked that whole bit for the world building because like Iskan got to sit down and ask about um, Druid stuff and and had it explained to him and stuff, and it was really cool. It was really, fun. I liked that. Like for me, it was like, why would you like you can't learn this like traditionally you just have to feel it right yeah like, to... and i i feel like that's a really good like apt like like way druids are it's like it's like a natural sort of feeling it's 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 yeah like you like if you like i feel like the only people that like can really like learn uh... as their class develops is like maybe like fighters and wizards because like you know they learn as it makes sense. I think monks too, or another one. Oh yeah, monks too. As well. Ah. Yeah, it was a really fun move. Yeah, I liked it. Also, these fucking lizard thingies are fucking weird looking. I like them. They're they're called N Nankos. Nank. No idea what they are. They're kind of like the yards that were. Oh my god, everyone's dying from poison. Asuna, oh. before it's too late. I'm them, yeah. This is a bad poison. Hold on. Let me Hold go. still! You can put a band aid on it. Let me suck the, the blood out of the, the snake bite wound. Which, by the way, that does not work. What? Sucking, like, that amount of a bite Oh, wound. yeah, it, it, does, it does not, yeah. Because the, the poison, the venom that would be hurting you is already, like, in your bloodstream and circulating through your body. It's, like... In fact, sometimes in cases, like, if you get bitten, like, by a venomous snake on the hand, and then you do a tourniquet, like, on the arm, that's worse. Because by the time, like, they take off the tourniquet, like, that... The one, the limb's gonna get, like, torn apart by, like, the venom, and two, once the tourniquet comes off, all that, like, badness is gonna start flowing. The badness flow. Monty's is a distracted healer. No one's died. No one has died. I want to point that out. That yeah. does not make me a bad healer. Look, I'm not the only one who's distracted. Everyone ran past the stone tablet. We need to proceed. I'm very. I'm yet. Yeah. No one's gonna die unless yet. they actively attempt to do so. <laughs> We're gonna fight Sojourn. The sojourn. Worm. This is the second stream in a row you fought a worm. Yeah. Uh, is this? No, 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 no. Uh, why me? Because Geek the Mage. Fuck off, worm. Geek the White Mage. Uh oh. 
Oh my god, there are people fishing off the dock right now. Why not? Great place to fish. Damn it, I got dropsy. Dropsy! Yeah, what the fuck is this boss fight? You gotta go in here so you don't get sucked into the whirlpool. Taking your damage. Nice. See, everyone here knows what they're doing. Everyone here is a pro gamer. Oh, so everybody outside the fight is, is a bad gamer? Wow, way to insult your cat. Okay, come on, don't be like Twitter. <laughs> Fuck off. <laughs> Uh, Twitter be like, oh man, I love pancakes. Oh, so you hate waffles? Is that it, huh? Everybody that likes waffles is an idiot? Fuck you. Oh, it's, 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 French toast advocate here. You know what? Respect. That's respect. Yeah, I like French toast too. I love French toast. Have you ever had a breakfast corn dog? No. So, so you take a breakfast sausage, you put it on a skewer, and like you cook it, but I'm... then you dip it in pancake batter and then fry that. I'm gonna be so real with you. I'm not a breakfast like uh, sausage person. No. Oh. I'm not a big fan. All right. I can feel our friendship waning. <laughs> it's, 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 no, no, it's it's okay. I'm just dead to you. <laughs> I'm, I'm just, it's it's that it's that panel of like when Buggy asks Luffy, like, "Hey, remember my Buggy Bob?" <laughs> no. no. Oh. Hold on. I need, can you, can you side track? Oda, Oda is so good at bombastic, crazy expressions, but nothing has captured like abject despair. As that fucking panel of buggy looking oh for- I'm very oh. sorry, I'm pulling for the tank, which is bad. There's a treasure chest somewhere. I'll eat your breakfast corn dogs, Daryl. Thank you, gentle. You're 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 a true bro. <laughs> I'm sorry. It's just a really convenient like breakfast thing, because you can also like dip them in syrup. And so like you have the syrup around the pancake batter that's around the sausage, and it's just a whole it's a whole breakfast thing, conveniently on a stick. Where is this thing? Have you made hat? No, no, no. We Thero, don't, have we you... don't want to go over there. We don't want to go over there. Oh, it's over here. I found it. I found it. Hold on. Michelle's asking. Thero, have you oh, made hash browns shit. on your grill? Irvine's dying. Uh, Hold on. I've done it twice, oh, and it's God. pretty Irvine's good. Irvine's dying. Irvine's dying. Oh. No. Uh, no. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. I got, got him. This. I got him. I got him. I got him. I got him. Oh, my God. That was actually frighteningly close. You guys all have debuffs. Yeah. I've made hash browns twice, and um, it's pretty good. No I, one I died, chat. No one died. I'm not distracted. Let me go find this treasure. Hold on. Guys, don't start the boss fight! God damn it. Uh-oh. It's okay. It's fine. It's fine. Ah! Oh my god. It's my time. Time to slay the hentai. Time to slay that hentai, baby. Time to earn my title. But first, let me open this treasure chest that I've been trying to open. Yep. Hold, brothers. But yeah, um... Cause there's a pet! There's a little pet you can get here called the, uh, the Naughty Nanka. I already have it, but I figured in case nobody has it, you guys can have it. Alright. All right, everyone, listen up. Listen up. Listen up. Don't, 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 don't. No! God damn it! I was gonna do a speech! Fucking god damn it, whatever. Fine. I was gonna okay. say, we have a duty to perform today. It's to slay this hentai, and I better see everyone not slack in here. The hentai slaying begins. Duty. Ow. But, um... Yeah, I've only made hash browns on the griddle twice, but at each time, like, the bacon Ow. grease puddles, and I put the hash browns in, like, the puddle of bacon grease, oh, and so yeah. it just absorbs it like a sponge. Give me that cholesterol, baby. Yeah! 
dude. I don't, I don't care it's that. It's okay. Like... Irvine wants to kill. He saw the hentai that needed to be slain. I, I get it. I understand. Plus, there's a uh, delay on stream, so it happens. Yeah. Yeah. A apparently, bacon is, like, full of carcinogens and, like, stuff that gives you cancer. I don't care. Give me the bacon. I do not care. Give, give me funny pork. Give me ham. Me want bite. Me want bite. Me want plant corn dog delight. Mess them up. Mess them up. Mess them up. Give me tasty chemicals. Yeah. No! Oh my god! Oh, oh my god! Holy shit! It's just. Uh, it just did you see took what them. it just did to Irvine? It flipped the bitch. Oh god, I got a rock. I gotta go. I gotta go. It's okay. Leave. I have the rock. I'm putting the rock over here. Oh god. Hello. Welcome to Holebreaker Isle. You wanna go check out the giant squid? Oh god. Don't let a hentai anyone else. Oh God, Natural bacon again. should be fine. It's just the curing in some bacon that's an issue. Find yourself a local butcher. Ooh. I haven't gone to my local, like... Oh God. Oh God. No! No! No, they got another one! Oh Ooh. my God. Holy shit. Oh Man, God. This fight's, Gentle. this fight's crazy. Gentle, I'm coming. I'm coming. Be healed. I have you. Not die. Behind us! Oh god. Oh my god. How do you do this fight? Fuck. Kill! Oh god, Jenna's dying again. Don't worry, I got. Oh god, Jenna. Jenna. Who the hell's Jenna? Oh god, Irvine. No, 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 no. Gentle, gentle, gentle. Oh god. Someone just got Great. needed. Great googly moogly. pandemonium. Ah! Oh god. Oh no, gentle died. Oh no! What is happening? This is absolute pandemonium. Why can't we target this fucker? Get him! You, Kill him! Apparently, apparently you just alive. need to kill We did it! <laughs> All right. One person died, and it wasn't from my neglect, so that's a win. All right. Yeah, go back to the ocean, you son of a bitch. I'll kill you next time. All right, what, what are the names? Uh, we have... I'll get them in a second here. Oh, my God. Look, and it's daytime now. Hooray. Dude, Gentle... I saved Gentle from the brink of death, and then he died. Where are they? They're over here. What does this do? Alright. Everybody, we killed the hentai. I'm very proud of you. I think all of you deserve the commendation for killing the hentai. But only one can get it. Only one can get it. I did like, I like the energy. I like that Irvine was like, no speeches, only violence. Irvine was like, Irvine. Irvin. Irvin was like, no, no speeches. I know what must be done. Gentle mm -hmm. died, but it's okay. We fixed it. And then it Shotan. I think Shotan did, did very good. Shotan. Right, Irvine, have, Shotan, and... We have Irvinheim. Irvinheim. Gentle. 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 G-E-N-N-A-L. And we have Shotan. C-H-O-T-A-N. C A C H A C H O Oh Cho Tan Okay All right Here we go Good job everybody You slayed the hentai I'm proud of you all
getting it. I'm surprised Gentle's not getting it, considering he died. Man. He died for the cause, man. Slaying hentai. That's the cause. Oh, I just got tea in my dice tray. Oh, shit. Oh, it's okay. Alright, it's going to Shotan. Very good job, Shotan. Congratulations. Alright, let's head out. Ooh, that's a spooky one next. Ooh, spooky. I will not spoil it, but after this dungeon, if you play yourself, there's a really cool reveal uh, for Enza here. So I recommend, mm -hmm. if you haven't done the Hullbreaker Isle side quest, I highly recommend checking it out, because there's a really, really cool reveal. Alright, next up, uh, we, where is this? Next one we got is a spooky one. Alright. We need to... Let's see. Uh, oh, there it is. Hold on. Uh, is there... Oh, they're right here. Okay. Uh, this is for the wolf's den. Okay. We need to catch another boat, actually. I got people leaning on me. I don't know if I should move. Oh my god. Oh, uh, oh we're moving. Okay, we're, we're all right. moving. I just don't know where we're moving to. Uh, this what? Uh, we're gonna teleport actually, just to make it oh, a bit shit. easier here. Uh, let's go. Let's go to Camp Tranquil, everybody. We're gonna go to Camp Tranquil. Camp Tranquil? Where is that? Oh my god, everywhere we go, it rains. Camp Tranquil, where Camp is Tranquil. that? Camp Tranquil, that is in South Shroud. Oh, there it is. I'm actually gonna use the bathroom real fast. Sure. So I'm just gonna place the camera here. Alright. And I'm gonna use the bathroom and I will be right back. Mm -hmm. I'll make sure to clean up the area. Chat, how you doing? I'm actually, um, I actually plan on, it's either, I might do it tonight. No, not tonight. But I want to, um, in the next, like, day or two, I want to make burgers on my griddle. Because we just got a bunch of ground beef, we just got a bunch of burger buns at the old, at the old Theropod household. I'm making burgers. Gonna make them on my fucking griddle. I also have, um, like, really big, like, stiff, like, stiff spatulas, so I'll be able to make smash burgers. It's gonna be so fucking good. I'm big, big excited. I'm vibing. Yeah. Ten in the morning, I'm making waffles. Wow. Waffles is a little tricky on the griddle, but I have made pancakes and they're 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 quite fun. They are quite fun. I have five pounds of spiral ham? Oh my god, dude. I want dude. I, it's a miracle I'm not like 400 pounds overweight, because I love food so much. What's your opinion on fried egg on a burger, Thero? You mean my favorite, like, thing to eat for breakfast? 
Like you just take a like a over easy egg and you put it in a burger? Yes. That is my favorite breakfast in the whole fucking world. Yes. Yes. You you take you take cheeseburger, put egg in it. Boom. Favorite breakfast. You cook often? Yeah. I'd say like every other day I cook it. I, I I cook every day, but like little meals, like like I I I, may, I like I make like quesadillas and stuff, super super easy, stuff like that. But like big like big meals and dinners and stuff, I'll I'll cook like every other day or like um, like I cook for my parents like dinner like maybe like twice a week. Goblins in her heated goblin is in her heated bed. Oh hell everyone, yeah! One that everybody got from her from, from my throne. Yeah, we're it's great. We're trying to. We're trying to clean up the area. Oh, good. Well, it's can, can it keep raining, so I don't know how much luck you're going to have with that. The, the, we, we'll just keep trying. Don't worry. Let me eat some uh, Oreos real fast. Yeah. I will say, the problem with the egg burgers is they are way too messy. Like, a burger is already really messy. Mm -hmm. You put an egg in that thing, oh... It is a fucking mess. It's just like adding water to it just to make it so much worse. Yeah. But, man. Man. You know, so, sometimes in life, you... Sometimes in life, it's okay to get a little messy. Sometimes in life, you know, just just get fucking messy. Mm. All right. All right, where are we going? Put your brooms away. Bring your chocobos out. Ladies and germs, we are going north. Let us ride. Yeehaw! Yeehaw! Let's go, everybody. Let's go. Run, run, run. Go, go, go. Where exactly are we going? We are going north. We're going to Central Shroud. Oh my god. Just look at look at this, though. Raining, river, creek, beautiful bridge. Oh. It's so nice. Giant gazelle. This is what, like, Final Fantasy is all about. Just, like, adventuring. Riding chocobos. Riding chocobos, adventuring. Man. It's like Crystal Chronicles, man. I love that game. Mm -hmm. the music is so good. The sense of adventure is so great. Wow, it is raining everywhere right now, huh? Man, it's just like real life. Jesus. It's good for fishing if anyone needs to fish. There's so many fish that only appear during rain. I was I was driving around today and it was just rainy as shit. I need to get back to fishing. It's a good excuse to watch anime. <laughs> uh, do we know where we're going? Nope. Oh, right. Okay, hold on. Uh, uh we're going this way. All right. This way, everybody. Where exactly are we going? We're going to the Tamtar Deep Crop. Oh my god. It's gonna get spooky. It's gonna get spooky. Alright. Where are oh we god, going? I think there was I think there was a sprout in here. Oh, was there? I think. Maybe. Maybe not. Never mind. Alright, this one's weird because it's a quest. Hold on. I just wanna check something really fast. Uh, it's so spooky. No, it is not here. Okay. No, it is not here. Okay. All right. Crisscross applesauce, everybody. Crisscross applesauce. Hmm. <clears throat> Do you guys remember? I'm just gonna point this out right now. Do you guys remember that adventuring party we met in a Realm Reborn, and how there was a group of people? 
who uh, were basically tearing into their healer because their tank died. Mm-hmm. Yeah. That healer is going to try and revive her dead friend. Oh, no. And is kind of having a Joker moment. Oh, no. All right. This is actually leads into the, um, oh god, what's it called? The, oh god, the, what's it called? Oh my god. The dungeon, the deep dungeon. Palace of the Dead. This is oh a shit. This is a precursor to the Palace of the Dead, actually. This is the precursor oh, dungeon and story. Oh shit. Yeah, the DPS were dicks to the healer, I remember. Yeah, and they disbanded. Uh, and then you get approached by one of the DPS, and they're like, I got a letter from our healer saying that she's gonna do some crazy shit. Uh, can you help me with that? And so you basically have been hired and find out that she's gonna try and revive her dead husband, who is a tank who is also an asshole. So, fun times in Cleveland today! Yeah, he was a dick to her as well. When the guiding light of one's life is extinguished, it takes uncommon strength of spirit to clamber out of the black pits of despair. Those who want for resilience may yet be pulled by a friend's helping hand. But what becomes of a broken-hearted maiden who has neither the strength nor the succor to overcome the darkness that threatens to consume her? The answer shall be revealed through the tragic tale that begins with the arrival of a single letter. Yeah, she had a mental breakdown. All right. Uh oh. Who's ready for spooky times? It's spooky month, but not really. Not really. Tamtar, deep crop hard. We need a DPS and two DPS and a tank. Password is uh one one nine two. Already if you were in Bray Fox or Holebreaker Isle, you need to sit this one out. Let other people play. Let other people in. I'll fucking kill you. We got Hase Bonse. We have A. Hey, we have Gentle in the party. Let's go. Ayo. Now we just need a tank. The, this this is a good dungeon. I haven't actually done this dungeon in a very long time, so I will probably mess up mechanics. So. So, dear lord, I need to shower after this dungeon. <laughs> uh -oh, I am stinky. stinky. We need a tank. We're still waiting on a tank. Jesus Christ, Thero. The skeleton. I'm recreating what we did in D&D &D today. L yeah, we did fight skeletons. And I, I did Shadow of the Colossus, the boss. That was fun. That was. Still looking for a tank, guys. We need someone who can be a tank. There we go. Sawyer Aster, thank you so much. Alright. Yeah. Got a tank? Anytime... You're going. No, go ahead. Go ahead. I was just going to say, anytime you, you ask your DM, can I do something stupid? It's always... You're always in for a good time. Hell yeah. I did, like, do a cool flip and, like, double kill two guys. That was really fun. Mm -hmm. Tanking scares me. Become Jonka. Where's Jonka? Where is he? There he is. Jonka, yeah. you, you must be brave. You must be brave like bear. And when things go bad, you must run like bitch. I, I mean like bear. Listen, you got this. Alright, we got this. You're, you're wearing more clothes than me and I tank, so it's you're It's gonna good. be spooky, okay? Don't get too scared, everybody. Don't get too uh, frightened, okay? Alright, let's do this. Go for it. Go, Sam go, Tardy go. Croft hard. Have fun! It's gonna get spooky. Getting spooked. Getting spooked. Someone is... Oh no, Sawyer! No, Sawyer no. disconnected. No, no, wake up! Oh no! Oh wake no! Up. Oh no, no, no! Oh dear! Oh, 
Sean Sawyer. In the arms of Kurt Angle. Oh, oh no! Oh. oh wow, they're gone, gone. Oh shit. Oh no. They're dead, Jim. They died. I can't even revive them. I can't take my computer's dying too strong. Oh no, I'll, do you want me to kick you from the party? Oh. Uh. <laughs> Fucking skeleton. Now's not the time, skellies. Yeah. Get out of here. Okay, I'll, I'll, I'll boot you out here. Uh, SMH. You, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Party. All right. You know what? Tanks line up here. Anyone who wants to be a tank, line up right in front of me. If you don't want to be a tank, don't show up in front of me, okay? If you want a tank, be in front of me here. We're gonna we're gonna do the American Idol tank edition. Oh my god. If you wanna be okay, we have Yace Gnome. Alright. We have Cali Mooton. We have the the Tombe Sugar Tongue. We have Alucardus Vernus. Alright, and we have we have Eltani. Alright, we have five tanks here. I'm I'm gonna this is what we're gonna do, everybody. I want you guys. We're gonna we're gonna go through some oh we have Thorn, okay. We're cutting it off here. No more tanks. If you didn't if you didn't have confidence walking up, you're done. Alright, everybody. We have six tanks here. I'm I'm gonna I'm gonna put you guys on the spot. Are you ready? Here's my question. Why should I take you into this dungeon as my tank? Alucardas, you were up first. Why why what is your pitch? Why what 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 do you bring to the table that no one else does? Sell me on this. It's a job interview, yeah. Hmm. What is this? Aorius has got talent. Um, I'm Cecil from Final Fantasy IV. That's pretty good. I'm not gonna lie. Mm -hmm. That is pretty mm -hmm. good. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay. All right. It would probably really help if I had played a bit more Final Fantasy IV. All right. We have Cecil from Final Fantasy IV. All right. Next up. The Tombe Sugar Tongue. It's so dark in here, man. Shit, there's there's like no light. <laughs> How does this give light? No, not at all. Hold on, maybe I got nothing that gives light. All right, the Dar Tombe Sugar Tongue. Why, why, why should I have you as my tank? Also, Arkol, thank you for the rating of the party at 31. Thank you so much. Oh, Arkol, what's up, dude? Thank you, thank you, Danny. Danny walked up behind the Tombe, put up a sun, and walked away. I respect the level 32 wanting to tank the level 50 dungeon. I respect that, too. Dan, like, dear Tombe, do you have a level 50 tank? Oh, my God. That might, that might disqualify you real fast. Uh-oh. Uh I'm waiting. I'm waiting, Dartambe. <laughs> I gotta give him some time to type. The rest of you, get your get your pitches ready. Get your pitches ready. I got ready. a dot 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 dot. Do you have a tank that's level fifty? Get get your pitches ready. <laughs> get them ready. Lines in a sun behind him. He does have courage. I respect that. Unfortunately, he's not level 50. <laughs> Is dot 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 your pitch? Disregard the Grand Duke Baller Pants disqualifies himself willingly. <laughs> Alright. Oh, he's he's leaving. Alright. That oh. brings us to Yace Gnome. We had someone who just disqualified themselves, so they, they left. What do you what do you got for me, Yace? What's your pitch? 
Why why should I hire you for this nine to five? Besides the fact that you're a pretty ara, and there's a fucking skeleton! Motherfucking skeleton! Guy, we're doing a job interview right now. I pew pew and hold M and enough said. Damn. To the point. Uh, brevity is the soul of wit. The pew pews are good. I like that, Yaste. I like that. Alright, that is Yace. Very good. Callie Mooton. Callie Mooton, why should I why should I bring you in as a tank? What's your pitch? What's your pitch, Callie Mooton? Minus points for not being a blue all raw? You shut your mouth. Anyone who plays the non like I don't know what the two names are, but this all raw has my respect, alright? Alright, Callie. What is- what is your pitch? I know to let you read to literal- I know to let you read literal lore drops in the dungeon. Okay, that's a good one. That is the lore. The lore sell point. I like that. That's pretty good. That's pretty good. That's pretty good. Very, very good. Alright. Altani. Altani, I respect you because you're usually the first person who shows up for my streams every time in in game. Take the Chad Gunbreaker. It is pr there. Listen, everyone's got to get their say in. All right, Altani, what is your pitch? What's your pitch for being a tank? One, I tanked Ultima. You know what I can do. Damn. Two, I won't get mad at distracted healing. It's also a boon. Three, I brought enough cookies and orange juice for the whole party. Shit. Snacks! Altani's got the snacks. That's pretty good. Oh, the audience likes that. The audience likes food. Free food is kind of a big good deal. That's, that's a pretty strong argument. We've dropped ley lines again. Alright. And last but certainly not least, our, our this, this is our blue jean samurai. Our blue jean samurai, Thorn. What is your pitch for being the tank for this dungeon? What is your pitch, Thorn? I'm wearing a suit for the undead wedding in the dungeon that Helen made for me, so I properly dress. Okay. Thorn has the drip. I'm writing down their 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 points here. Okay. This is really involved. This is very involved. We're, we're we're gonna be here all night. That's very dashing. And very good job, Helen, on the on the seamstress ship on that. It's pretty good. Alright. So here's what we got. Where the fuck did Cecil go? Cecil, calm down. Holy shit. Alright, we got Cecil from Final Fantasy IV. We got Pew Pew. We got lore. We've got snacks and we got drip. The rest of you guys here. Again, I'm gonna go through what we have here. We have, we have Final Fantasy IV. I am good, Helen. We have Final Fantasy IV. We have Pew Pew. We have Lore, Snacks, and Drip. I would like everyone who is here in game to type in chat who what they want. Like what 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 to them is the the highest value for them. Okay, Final Fantasy IV, Pew Pew, Lore. Snacks or drip. Let's hear it. Okay, we got, we got, yeah, you guys decide. I'm not gonna say. Let's see. Okay, okay. Ooh, 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 ooh. Everyone's thinking on it. Everyone's ruminating. Okay, okay, okay. We're tied. We're tied two for two. Has everybody said something? I think we're missing some people. Oh, am I am I supposed to say? Yeah, everyone, stuff everyone, who, everyone who's in this line right now. I need I need a vote here. Okay. Mm. Drip drip is doing well. Pew pew, lore. It's a tie between pew pew and lore right now. Drip drip. Lore lore. Drip. 
lore, lore. Okay. It looks like we're going for lore. I will say my vote would have been pew pew. I like the violence. It's good. Altani, I'm not gonna lie. I want to save you for when the danger begins. <laughs> so we're gonna we're gonna go with lore. The people have spoken. Get in here. Get in here, Callie Mooton. I'd laugh my ass off if they poke a ball immediately. <laughs> it's okay, oh, Cecil, from Final Fantasy IV. I would vote for you if I knew more about Final Fantasy IV. I'm gonna be honest. All right, <laughs> we got Callie Mooton in. We got lore. Let's do this. Let's ready check here. Make sure everyone else is good to go. Thank you for entertaining my shenanigans. Let's get into it. And thank you for having entertaining shenanigans. <laughs> Fine, watch us again on Eorzea's Got Talent. Oh, God. I love it. Oh, I love it. I love all the scary candles and demons. Demons. <laughs> Makes me think of that bit from Game Grumps where it's just like, he's like, they're at like the Forsaken Fortress. He's like, oh man, that's a beautiful, beautiful architect. Who was the designer again? Uh, Satan? <laughs> <laughs> All right. Tally, Hase, I'm not gonna judge you, but you better make some portraits. You're in an MMO. The drip is very important here. Okay, there is lore, so we're gonna take these nice and slow. That is what you promised me, Callie, so... It's spooky! Alright, let's read this here. Torn folio. I finally mustered the courage to speak with your hero, my love. Patience is as kind and wise as she as she is brave and strong. She listened attentively as I told her all about you, about us. Though she is a woman of few words, or perhaps because she is everything she she said seemed to inspire me, why her gaze alone instilled me with a confidence I never knew I had. Truly I feel better prepared to face the future for having met her. How right you were, my love. I'm scared. I, uh... Okay. I'm scared. She went through a very traumatic thing, and she had a parasocial relationship instead of, you know, figuring that out, I guess. I was a tier three sub to Pokimane and she said my name once. Oh God. I'm gonna hit this thing. Oh! God, I hope this hits everybody. Okay. Dead. Nice. Yeah. It's getting a little chaotic here. It's getting a little crazy. Curse you demons. Nice. Alright, we may proceed. Oh, there's a torn folio over here. Never mind. Don't proceed, don't proceed. Oh shit, they proceeded. Can you go deal with that, Callie? I'll throw a, a regen on you. Hold on, let's deal with <laughs> this and then we'll have to read. Funny, funny regen. I... I was promised lore, I will devour the lore. Scarcely a week has passed since we returned to the village, and already I cannot help thinking it was a mistake. There was a time when this place seemed just large enough, but having seen the wider world, it all feels so insufferably confined that I often find myself struggling for breath. I know that it is the same for you, my love. The only time I feel truly alive is when I'm adventuring with you. 
We are as caged birds in this backwater. So long as we remain here, we will never spread our wings and soar. So let us take to the road and create a lifetime of wonderful memories together. So her and her fiancé set out to become adventurers. And then he died. Her DPS has yelled at her. Uh, and she... I guess she talked to me and said that she appreciated my efforts. And then she just fell apart, clearly. Oh god, oh god, Callie's taking a lot of damage here, hold on. I got you, I got you, I got you. This is just a saga that keeps going. I'm glad we went with the lore person here. I could not have hoped for a more romantic first visit to Mordona. The crystals that pierce the landscape glowed in all their majesty as if to celebrate our future together. And as we lazed by Silver Tear Lake watching the waves lapping on the shore, the sun took its leave behind the horizon that we might enjoy a moment of intimacy. I want us to be together forever. You said these words to me years ago, and then you said them to me again tonight. I'm so happy to be with you. They had sex! Oh man. Stop praying to the dark gods! Get moving! We're not a part of a cult! I can only handle one cult in one stream, thank you. Praise be the wheel. God, this dungeon theme is spooky, man. Oh. That's- that's one of her- DPS friends. Quote unquote friends. Well. Oh shit. All the music. Oh my god. Best man? Oh my god. Bridesmaid? Oh my god. Ow. It's a red wedding, folks. Oh Jesus. Oh Jesus. I do not remember this. Okay, I don't remember how this fight goes. Um, Hase has eight stacks of vulnerability. Oh, that's Hase okay. is now dead. Holy shit, oh god, Callie's dying now too. Okay, that is not my fault. I'm just gonna say that right now. There's no- oh god, oh god, oh god. Oh my god, it's happening again! <laughs> what key noise is this? Oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god. Uh oh. Don't no. attack the ads? Okay, so no AoEs then. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, time to disband the group. Uh, you all suck. Uh, uninstall. Uh, never play the game again. Uh... Okay, so don't hit the zombies. Again, it's been a while since I've done this dungeon. I don't think I've done this one since I unlocked um, Palace of the Dead. So. When she targets someone's stack and let the boss kill the adds, it won't damage you that way. Oh. oh. Okay, 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 okay. Oh. Nobody let me down! Everyone's doing their best and I love and appreciate them. Also, hi, our call. <laughs> this is a wow we're nice when we wipe. I know, I know, I'm referencing a video that, that yeah. mentions that. What? Okay, fuck him up, Callie, let's do it. What do you mean, we wipe? Yeah, we, we just try again. Let's go again. What, what if we wipe again? Let me do that. Let me do together. Wow. Okay, so don't hit... Don't hit the zombies. 
Le Vivid, yeah. You gotta go kill the Unfortunately, guy. the guy went back to playing WoW, but... Yeah, that's how most abusive relationships, unfortunately, are. <laughs> oh, dude. Sorry. Uh, <laughs> you right, though. Okay, this is going way better this time. Do we have any lore that I miss? Is there any, any lore I should be aware of? There's some lore over there. And there's some lore right here. Hold on. You've been looking you have been looking deathly pale of late as late. The scorching heat of Thanaland does not agree with you. You were never fond of hot climbs, and it was a mistake to come here. Let us meet for Kurthus, where the bracing air will put roses on your cheeks. He's dead. He was dead. I think that was written after he died. Uh, Hase, he did. Hase, are you gonna are you gonna poke that coffin? This very evil coffin. Okay, Callie, Callie, it's a haunted coffin, Callie. No. Oh God. Well, Callie's haunted. Callie, this isn't Steve the ghost. This is this is an asshole ghost. Really oh, there's a big man! Oh my god. Oh god. Help! Ah! Ah! Callie! Ah! This fucking Mr. X is walking through the hallways. Alright, we're good. I'm gonna read lore here. Don't touch- don't you touch- Hase, don't you touch that coffin. You touch it, it's cursed. I'm gonna read, okay? I know, I know. It's not easy being without a body. Huh. I promised to find one for you, but you must have patience. Hey, that's me. You are my husband-to-be, and there's nothing I would not do for you. So please, have faith in me. Give me time, my love, and I shall make you whole again, as you make me. <laughs> hey, Arkolf, are you, are, you are you in the chat right now? Arkolf? Arkolf? Arkolf, my beloved? Arkolf? My beans. Arkolf, Arkolf, would you love me if I was a worm? I am still here for the moment. Okay, if I ever die, don't do this shit, okay? <laughs> Just put me don't. in the ground, okay? Just put me in the ground and move on. <laughs> Alright, uh, you know what, Hase? I can t yeah, just, just, yeah, just let your, just let your, your impulses come out. Oh no, oh. the impulses! Let the intrusive thoughts win. Body. I'll burn your body? When I'm dead, right? <laughs> <laughs> Anakin Skywalker meme. When I'm dead, right? I don't know if I want to be burned when I die. I think I want to be put in the earth raw. I, um, I want my body to be donated to sciences. That too. I would, I would want to donate my organs. I, I'm not using my body anymore, so like, if, if like, if any of my organs could be, like, used for, like, a student to, like, learn about the liver or heart or something, like, fuck yeah, dude. I don't want to give up my, my heart for nerds or anything like that. I would give it to, like, people who need an organ transplant. Oh, yeah. Well, the, the thing is, like, I hope that, I hope, not I would, that I die old. And, like, normally, like, old people organs aren't, like, used for donations because they're, like, old. Yeah. But, um... So, hopefully, I die old, and then, like... Oh, wait, I hold on. Arkulp, I want a like... Viking funeral. Can you put me on a boat and catch me on fire? Like, if I'm gonna be on fire, that's the way I want to go. Like, obviously, um, it says on, like... I don't know if they have the same thing in Canada. On my driver's license, it has that red dot that's, like, an organ donor thing. I don't know what we have. Yeah. All right. So, 
So. Is there lore? Am I missing? Oh, there is a lore thing. Okay, hold on. I need to read spooky lore. Go ahead. I'm sorry to keep you waiting, my love, but we cannot afford to compromise, not when your new body is concerned. Ordinary adventurers die often enough, leaving their ordinary corpses. But if you were to be like patience, we cannot settle for anything less than extraordinary. But a strong body requires an equally strong soul, as I recently discovered. Now you are probably worried that strong souls are rare, and so they are, but never fear, for we can create one ourselves. All we need is a plentiful supply of the weaker kind, and they are common indeed. Be patient just a little longer, my love, and all will be as you desire. I'm gonna touch this thing now. Crazy, crazy bitch. Ghost. Oh, I'm scared. Yeah. Oh. Yeah, basically, I have a red dot on my driver's license, so heaven forbid if, like, I get I'm into being, an accident. I am being punched! My organs will be used to help people. This is scary. I want to be cremated and my ashes compressed into a diamond and I demand people refer to me as a soul gem. Whoa. Oh, Can hey. You can you crush ashes into diamonds? It's her other DPS. That's just a wall of hell. I don't remember what's the worst this. Thing? What's the worst they can do? I don't remember how this fight goes. Callie. I don't remember how this one, how this one. He's the guy who gives you the quest, by the way. He asks you to come with him to this place. Because he's like, what the fuck is happening? Keep him alive. Okay. Then we'll do that. And keep hey, the boss away the from him. Fuck? You got it. Alright. Uh, that's water. It's water. We're good. Alright. Oh shit. Okay, so we have, to, we have to kill everything before it touches them. Uh. I see, I see, I see. Ow. Alright. Ooh, 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 ooh. Callie, 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 Callie. I think you need to move. Okay. Watch out, watch out, watch out! Watch out, watch out, watch out. Get healing. Cure, 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 yeah, cure. Gotta... Get healed, get healed, get healed, get healed. Yeah, we gotta keep this guy away from this little guy. Oh my god, oh my god, Hassi Basse. Oh no. Oh god, he's getting hurt. Oh shit. I believe in you. Kill it, kill it, kill it, kill it. Oh, we're good. I thought I was done for. I owe you one. I can't stand being here any longer. I'll see you outside. Fucking run. Oh, man. More lore? Oh, there is lore. Guys, there's lore. Guys, there's lore. Oz. No pull. Only lore. With the nigh-endless supply of bodies here, I will make you well again, my love. Then we shall be wed as man and wife and forever be joined as God is, as the gods intended. Of course, it is only fitting that a proper ceremony be held with guests and attendants. I will send out invitation to all our friends. They will be so happy for us, I have no doubt they will jump at the chance to part with their souls. Oh shit, I just risked- oh. I got you, I got you, I got you. I didn't notice you were fighting, I'm so sorry. I was very distracted reading. Also, that that explains the letters you get at the beginning of the quest line that make you kind of set out on this, so. Go for a Cali. We're good. Oh, I think a random Hrothgar has joined us. A random Hrothgar? Yeah. I love I love it when we meet new friends. Like Derek. God, I hope Derek's doing good. Mm -hmm. Has 
Somebody named Luft Ape Man. Luft Have they ever Ape. been in the... That name is familiar. Okay, so maybe, maybe they're really good. I, I, I don't That name is very them. familiar. Hello. Hello, Cat Man. Get the guy. I'm depressed. Rather. Oh, they're in chat. Oh, I rarely have Friday's off. Yeah, so luck. Uh, okay, all right, yeah. all right. Sorry, I, I don't rarely, recognize you. I rarely there's, have there's Friday's lots of off. People. My parents enjoy. I was gonna say Left Eight Man sounded very familiar. Well, if if you rarely have Fridays off and you chose to be here, I appreciate that. What are you doing? Thanks, okay. <laughs> no, I'm just joking. What? what? <laughs> that's it. That's it. That's it. That's it. <laughs> Avery, all these people have come to make you a gift of their souls. Isn't that nice? Even Patience is here. Now your dream of becoming like her can come true. Ah! Ah! Spooky! Also, I was gonna say, like, that one Sonic meme, like, Oh, you're alone on a Friday night? God, you're pathetic. Okay. Oh god. Okay, we're just going. Oh, oh okay. Thank All you right. ever so much for coming to our wedding. Your body means the world look to Avery. Where are our witnesses? The ceremony can't begin without them. Uh, I'm assuming we want to kill these things, right? To have and hold for better or worse, for richer or poorer. Callie is dying. I'm gonna fix that real fast. This, this is a one shot. This reminds me of a one shot I did, which um, I, I I call it the Banshee in the basement, which is a uh, basically uh, a guy hired um, what he thought were like this clerics, is, but this is fucked up, by the way. Oh my yeah, god. Yeah, this is very fucked up. You mind waiting for the story after we're sure, sure, this? Sure. Yeah. Sure, sure. ADD brain going off. This reminds me of a riddle. God, oh God, oh God, oh God, oh God, oh God. Ooh. This is like a tower defense thing. Very cool, very, very fun. Oh, those arms are nerve endings. Oh my God, gross. The nerve of it all. Oh, cool, I got an item. I love the delightful victory music in the middle of a creepy fight. <laughs> oh my god. To hold, in sickness and in health, to love and to cherish till death do us part. It was so poorly timed. We are not happy to win that one. Not good. Alright, let me get that pole. Alright, we have... 
our tank, Tally. We have Aya. And we have Hase. Um, fun, fun little fact, if you do this quest line, um, she haunts you. I forgot her name. Uh, Edda. Edda will actually, like, stalk you in cities. You can randomly see her, like, at a distance, like, watching you. It's really creepy. Oh, that is creepy. Oh, Connor! They were in party of 34. Thank you so Ayo, much. Ayo, Connor, what's up? <laughs> oh, no, don't make that the oh, fucking great message. Oh, my God. It's not, it's past Heaven's Word, you fools. It's Stormblood now. It goes up to Stormblood. Oh, my God. You fools! <laughs> it's Stormblood now. Which is incredibly generous. Like, that's a lot of content. That is so much fucking That's an content. absurd amount of content now. <laughs> but, um... Basically, the, the premise of that one shot I made a while back, it was, what if a guy tried to get his wife resurrected? And oh. the people that did it weren't clerics, they were um, evil cultists. Ah. And also, so the spell component Kali. made... Kali is the winner of the combination. Ooh, nice. Sorry, nice, Sarah, nice. I don't mean to interrupt your story, but the time yeah, is yeah. a little rough right now. Sorry. Kali, thank you so much. You were a fantastic tank. You gave me lore, and I appreciate that. Thank you so much. Good job, Kali. Very, very good. Sorry you almost died because I didn't notice you were being assailed. My bad. The WoW free trial is only up to level 30 or so. This is a hell of a lot more meat to the free trial. Oh, yeah. Final Fantasy well, the, has the best the, free trial in, in, in any MMO, honestly. Yeah, the, the WoW free trial is awful. You can't use, like, the auction house. You can't... To be fair, like, it's to avoid bots, and I, I completely yeah. agree with that decision 100%. Yeah. Oh yeah, but you can't like. I think you can't even like whisper other players. You can't no. like. I think you can do say chat, but that's it. Um, yeah, and it's only like level twenty or thirty. It, yeah, it's, it's not good. It's... Yeah. All right. Well, did I bring anything from the wedding, guys? It wasn't a wedding. It was a wake, disguised as a wedding. Yeah. <laughs> oh my lord. Oh, you guys doing push-ups? Hold on, let me, let me yep. get in on this. Oh, you wanna you wanna get in on this action? Look at that! I time it perfect every time. It's not perfect on my screen, but we out here. It's perfect on my screen. Look at me. Yeah, yeah, it's weird because yeah, I'm looking at your stream and it's perfect, and on my screen it's not. Kind of weird. Uninstall. There's Luff Eight Man. That's a great Rothgar design. We have yeah. we have Sticks who who plays Rothgar. But it is always nice to see more Roths. I don't see a lot of them. Yep. Too many cat girls! And dragon not enough, girls! Not enough cat men! We need cat men! I saw some great art of someone who drew, like, a really jaded-looking, like, old cat dude smoking a cigarette, just like, shit. <laughs> well, she was trying to get ahead in life. Sorry, Danny. 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 I I mean, she was just putting her neck out for her friends. <laughs> Danny's... Bruh. <laughs> Come on, Danny. Come on, Danny. <laughs> oh, man. So we have two more dungeons left. Um, oh, boy. I really would love to finish them. Let's do um, it, then. No, I'm too tired, and I don't want to push oh, okay. it. okay. I, yeah, yeah, yeah. I, yeah. I'm really <laughs> starting to get a little tired. It's not like, like, everything's good. I'm having a lot of fun. But the thing is, like, my body is like, hey, this is enough. We need to stop. Nope. And yep. I probably should go lie down. I'm yep. feeling better, and I don't want to, like, push it too hard and do exactly, too much. Exactly, yeah. So. As much as I'm like, yeah, keep, no, no, listen to your body. Yeah. We're gonna, um, we're gonna call it here. Uh, I, I feel bad because we were just raided in two, but um, we're going to call yeah, it. I fine. mean, it's it's 10 p.m. anyway. We did start late. I do apologize. We streamed for basically two hours or so. Yeah. Um, again, I'm very sorry that we're not going to continue, uh, but we have two more dungeons that we need to finish. We have Stone Vigil Hard and we have Sastasha Hard, so two more 
and then we can move on to uh, more plot stuff. We can move on to, I believe our next thing is going to be, um, let me see here. I'm just looking at what I have for a write-up. So we have, oh, I didn't write it down. So we have dungeons next. In dungeons. We have the white mage quest line. Okay. Ooh, the white mage quest line is going to be fun. That one's going to be long. That's also going to be good. Yeah. Uh, so we have the white mage quest line, and then we have Bahamut. Bahamut. Bahamut raid. Which. Garuda, Bahamut. And then um, pretty after mama. that, we're going to have. Um, Oh, after what? that, I think we're doing Hildebrand. <laughs> okay. Yeah, we have Hildebrand after Bahamut. Uh, and then we have... Uh... Yeah, we have a lot of stuff after this. Only do what you want to do. Yeah. Connor and all caps and chat. Hildebrand. Hildebrand. Yeah, we gotta do Hildebrand. And then we have. Okay, this this probably makes the most sense. I'm I'm hiding the the stuff after Hildebrand because it's a secret. What we're gonna be doing after Hildebrand. <laughs> Um, but there's going to be a fun little thing after Hildebrand, uh, just to make the plot stuff kind of make sense. So we have, we have quite a list of things to do. So we can finish the last two dungeons and then we're going to do the white mage quest line for level one to 50. Uh, and then we're going to do the Bahamut raid and then we're going to be doing Hildebrand. And then we're going to be doing three things after that. One of which is crystal tower. Um, but we're going to have a couple of things before that. And then eventually we're going to get back into the story. We're going to be going post Realm Reborn. Um, this is, this is a very dense part of the playthrough. Um, especially for Realm Reborn. Like there's the story for Realm Reborn is relatively like it sets up the scene, the post game stuff. There's so much of it. Um, so we'll be doing, uh, we'll be doing that. So, uh, all right, well, that, that's going to be the stream. Let's go maybe somewhere where there's some more light. Let's go outside, everybody. I could use... We've got to get away from outside. these... Outside! we got to get away from these bones. These skeletons. Look at that. The sun is rising. It's a beautiful day outside. There's fucking shrieks of dying animals behind me. Yep. Uh, look at this. Uh, Good times. Beautiful piano playing. Oh. Very nice. Very tranquil. Look at this. It's so nice. Yeah. Alright, everybody. We're Someone's being attacked. Oh, it's dead. You guys might want to back up a little bit. We are going to end the stream here. We are going to raid somebody. Yeah, back up if you can. I can't really back, back up. up. Back up. Everyone back up. Back up! Back, you beast! Back up, if you can. So that way people can fit in. Everyone fit in. Ignore the fate that's happening behind us. Uh, as long as you don't level think you're good. Yeah, we're good. Thank you guys so much for joining me. I really wish we could have finished the dungeons today. We have two more, but we'll probably finish the last two and then jump into the White Mage quest line. I don't know how long the White Mage quest line will take. It's probably going to be decently long. Um... And then after that, we're going to be doing a Bahamut Raid. I will say this, for the Bahamut Raid, we are doing it unsynced. We are not going to be doing the fights as intended. I don't have the patience nor the time to learn those janky old fights. They are, in my opinion, not fun at all. Um, so we're going to just kind of blitz through it. And we're going to um, we're gonna go and do it for the plot line. Um, the age, I think the age of A Realm Reborn really really shines in the Binding Coils of Bahamut, unfortunately, but the story is very important and very good. So. It's a good time. It is a good time. 
Alrighty. Well, thank you guys so much for joining me. Thank you so much if you did a dungeon with me. Thank you guys so much if you're just here to hang out. That's really, really enjoyable. Thank you guys so Thanks much for the Yeah, thank you guys so much for coming through with some cool glams. I think this is going to be really, really cool. I will say this, um, when we do Binding Coils of Bahamut, it's kind of putting the carpet for the horse. Come with a really cool glamour. Like, come with a really, like, cool adventure glamour would be my request, so... Yeah. Mm -hmm. This is a lot of fun. Again, I'm sorry I couldn't stream for longer, but I'm, I'm really, I'm really feeling it. And I still need to shower, so I'd like to shower before going to bed. Because I, I smell uh, pretty... Stinky. Smell like, I smell like a gamer. Alrighty, well, with that, we need to raid somebody. Hmm. Sorry, Connor, that we're kind of, you know, jumping... Throwing one raid to the other, it's the fine. other, yeah, I apologize. I see Stacy's on, Kaiju Plus. I see that Octopimp is on, too. Ooh, Octopimp's good. Let's raid Octo. Yeah. They they took a picture, if you want to check their Twitter, of them needing the a sphinx cat. cat. Yeah, yeah, I saw that. I love that it was like yeah. rubbing up against his beard, and I was going to comment and be like, it craves the hair. <laughs> <laughs> It's jealous of you. You know what? That'll be a raid message. It craves the hair. That is horrifying. No, but it's great. Yes. It's perfect. It's the best message. Once I see it in chat, we'll raid. It craves the hair. Is the is our raid message? Is the is the raid going? Did you type no, it right? No, I'm I'm waiting until I see it in chat. All right, it craves the hair. All right, get out of here, everybody. Have a good night. I will catch you guys uh, maybe Monday uh, for more. Well, actually, Christmas is happening. I'll catch you next time. Bye-bye. Good night, everybody. Right now. Right now. Right right now. 69. 69.